a lot of people ask us about what we do with um, the ferals and how we sort of win them around. We've had a lot of new ones in recently. Um, so an evening time maybe, um, one of the things we would do is bring them into the home environment and uh, build their trust. Um, behind the couch here, we have a couple of dogs hiding at the minute. Uh, this is normal for life around here. Um, it, it may seem upsetting, but we know that we'll get them there in the end, which is what keeps us going and keeps us smiling. Um, obviously food is a, is, is a really useful thing because they're all, usually always food motivated. Wet food's great, they really love that. So I kind of make all the food come from us and then that gives them the association that every time we reach towards them, something good's gonna happen. And then, you know, you can see the change over time. Um, we never know how long it's gonna take. Obviously like with Emma recently, you know, you can see that can take years and years. But we've got high hopes for these two. So, behind the couch we have Sammy. Hello, there's my little Sammy. What's coming, Sam? Here we go, Sam Sam. Come on. Come on, Sam Sam. Come on, Sam Sam. Come on, Sam Sam. Good boy. Good boy. They're always so gentle. Good boy, you take it. I'm putting it on a fork just so it takes him a bit longer because he's never had this before. This is like the first day of doing this. So in future, he'll just grab the fork probably and be really confident. But I just want him to take the time to work out how to get it off the fork instead of worrying about my hand or what else might happen. Um, whoopsie. The other little one here is Daria. Um, she's hiding with him. Hello, darling. Yesterday, we did have a little bit of brightiness from Darry. Um, what we get it? What about this? No. She did take, um, let me just try the other treats. Hello, darling. What's this for little Sam Sam? Hey. Oh, we're moving on to all sorts. These are all sorts, Sammy. Oh, is that a little tail wag? Can I hear your tail wagging? Good boy! I talk to him when I do it because then you get them used to your voice because often, hello, baby. often they see voices and good girl, what's that? It's a big test if we'll take it from your hand. She normally takes it from the floor if I just drop it but the day she takes it from the hand will be a good day. Walk it down then. Hey, drop another one. No, on the floor still, that's fine. Here we go, Sam Sam. Where's my little Sammy? Where's my beautiful Sammy? Oh, there he is. Oh, there he is. Good boy. Hey, yes. Every so often, just give her a little bit of a touch just to get her used to the desensitization. Hello, my darling. I want to run around the room screaming and being all excited, but you can't get too excited because it'll freak them out. What did you say? What's on my hand? It's a good day. It's a good day. You can have another for being a good girl. Oh, she's a good girl, is Daria. Sam Sam, you're being very punchy, aren't you, lovely? Here we go, Sam Sam. Oh, uh, yeah, so afternoon, evening, being spent hanging over the back of the sofa. Looking forward to the day when they'll be on the other side of the sofa. Hello. Good girl. Oh, Sam Sam. Sam Sam's getting up. He wants the full force. Sam Sam, you beautiful boy. Isn't he beautiful boy? You will be beautiful. We just got you, Sam. It helps if you have them in twos because when they're on their own they feel too isolated whereas if they hear the other one eating it it motivates them to eat a phone don't we yeah go on then oh she's a good girl she's a good girl yeah 